Hi, this is John McGraw with John McGraw Photography. Today I'm in beautiful Northern England in the Lake District, and I'm gonna talk about our driving experience here, uh, both in England, Wales, and then also a few months ago we were in Ireland. So in the US, we drive on the left side of the car and on the right side of the road. Uh, here, they drive on the right side of the car and the left side of the road. So I'd say the biggest thing that we learn, a couple things would be, you wanna take a quick left and you wanna take a wide right. So anytime you're pulling out, it's the opposite. You're gonna to wanna to pull quick to the left, wide to the right. And then the other thing is the roundabouts that they have here. Um, in the US, we would go around to the right. Here you go to the left. And what the GPS will tell you is uh, take your first left, which you'll just go in the roundabout. You'll go to the left and go to the left. And then if it says go through or over, you're gonna to go to the left again, and you're gonna usually go to the second or third exit. It'll usually tell you, but you're really going straight. You just have to go around the roundabout and then straight. And then if it says take a right, you're still going to the left, of course, and then you go to the right. It'll usually say the third or fourth exit, something like that. The fourth is usually behind you, uh, but usually the third is to the right. Sometimes there's four or five, uh, but usually there's three-ish, three, four, something like that. So uh, as a pedestrian, you also want to watch that you're looking the other way. Uh, in the major cities, they'll actually have right on there, make sure to look to your left or to your right, whatever it needs to say. Um, but, but just make sure that, that you're looking both directions like always, like you're taught as a kid. But in this case, you want to make sure you're looking the opposite way because your instinct, you've been brought up a certain way, you're used to certain norms. Uh, the good thing is I've only had one incident here uh, in the UK where um, I was doing a bunch of different things. Um, the steering wheel is, like I said, on the right side of the vehicle. All your pedals are the same, but you are shifting. If you're gonna do an uh, a manual, you're gonna be shifting with your left hand. We have an automatic, but it's kind of a weird car where you have to press in this button and hit it a certain a few different times to get it to reverse, neutral, or drive. So I was turning around, I was trying to do all that, and then trying to figure out where I was. I was a little bit frustrated. I did pull out on the right hand side and the car was coming. I just waved my hands, I said, sorry, sorry. He was, he was mad at first, then really nice once he realized I was, I was trying to apologize. Another thing is um, the roads are really small. So uh, you're on the left side, somebody's coming at you. If there's not enough room for two cars to go by, then you'll just pull over a little bit to the left. On some of the really small roads, they have some pullouts that you'll pull over to. And then if you do that, um, usually the driver that goes by you in Ireland, they would just kind of go one finger on top of the hand, uh, on top of the wheel, they'll just kind of go like that. Um, here we've noticed they do a full wave, uh, whether those were English or Welsh um, people doing it, or if they're tourists, I'm not sure, but it's more of a hand wave here. Just a quick hello, thank you. Or you'll flash your lights if you want the other person to go uh, on a small road. So um, there are some roads that are just one length of a, or width of a car that you really will have to pull over. And then on most of the roads, they're really small, really windy, and you're going back and forth. You're going through curves and watch the speed. If it says 30, go 30 because they're putting it on there for a reason because a lot of the roads they'll put 60 miles or in the in Ireland it'll be uh, you know 80 kilometers or whatever so they they really mean it when they they mean to slow down because they'll have 60 on some roads that um, I would never go 60 on so really watch those there'll be some small towns that you'll come through it'll tell you right there on the road usually to slow down and then when you're in Wales, it's going to be uh, both in English and in Gaelic. Um, I'm sorry, in, in Welsh. Um, in Ireland, it's going to be Gaelic and, and English. So you'll see both on the signs. So uh, I hope you, you've liked what you've seen here. Uh, please, please hit the subscribe button and see more videos from our travels around the world.